Landlords should be forced to create more energy-efficient homes and private landowners made to hand over their land for forestation, according to the Scottish Greens. In an exclusive interview, Patrick Harvey said that rich landowners who use their properties for driven grouse hunting should be legally required to allow tree planting on their land to enable Scotland to match European forestation rates. He also said that private landlords must make upgrades to homes they rent out, to make sure they are more energy-efficient and climate-friendly. Speaking to the Herald on Sunday, the co-leader of the Scottish Greens said grouse moors were unproductive and unprofitable and added, it is used as a playground for rich people to come and kill things for fun. Reforesting a huge amount of that land would be profitable for the economy. It would be ecologically sensitive and create a space for biodiversity to flourish. Harvey argues that just 19% of the country is forested at present, causing Scotland to lag far behind the European average of 40%. He also claims that the current Scottish government rate of forestation, it would take 150 years to reach this 40% forestation level seen across the rest of the EU. When asked whether private landowners would be consulted before their properties were used for forestation, Harvey said, I don't know, did they ever ask us to if they could have a driven grouse moor? No, their ancestors stole it or had it stolen for them. The government can regulate that. Taxation is another way. A land value tax that is properly managed would create incentives for the decentralization of land ownership. Earlier this week Nicola Sturgeon caused uproar when she said that peat lands were not being intentionally burned in Scotland, a statement disputed by opposition politicians and climate activists who said that landowners do burn their land to keep it barren for hunting animals. TV presenter Chris Backham said that of all the calamitous comments made by leaders in the Channel 4 climate debate, it was Sturgeon's claim which made me shout loudest. Harvey said that housing improvements should be another focus of government following this year's general election, and added that private landlords should be made to properly insulate their homes and make them energy efficient. He explained, we have a huge number of people living in the private rented sector and landlords don't have to do any sort of energy mo or bring their properties up to a decent standard. If you had the money you could, in theory, speak to your landlord to do the work yourself but why should you pay if it is to increase the value of the landlord's property? Why would the landlord pay if it is not going to benefit them immediately? There's a real legal mismatch there, and I think for more on this story, visit the news article link.